2024 is going to be about making seven figures, okay? But anyways, in this video, we're going to talk about how to make six figures, guys, because it's still popular. It's still popping. You can easily do this. But I'm not going to lie to you. In the beginning, it's going to take a little bit of um, consistency. It's going to take a good positive mindset, and you got to stay focused, and you got to continue to trust in the process and that's going to be the hardest part for a lot of these people because they're so conditional to where they just want to hurry up and get the results so they're looking for the hack they're looking for the bullshit but hopefully in this video i can blow your mind about something okay guys a lot of people what they're doing is they're trying to hurry up and sell you a product they're trying to sell you and i'm trying to tell you right now you need to be sharing your experience with the product and if you do not believe this is a successful way of making money, look, most of the people I know that have really done this and have mastered this, they went on to make more money than me faster. Because number two, because I'm going to tell you right now, when I first started, okay, um, when I was like doing the daily pay thing, I was actually doing it and not even knowing that I was doing it. And then I kept trying to change my content because, you know, I mean, I was trying to Follow kind of what works, right? Which is fine. It worked. It made me six figures, but it would have gone a lot faster if I would have just shared every part of my experience, right? If I would have just shared my growth, what I'm learning, what we're doing, things of that nature. Now, I kind of did and I kind of didn't. Like when I first started, I was so excited uh, for the thing that I was promoting at the time because we were doing the daily videos, right? And this was daily pay, by the way. So anyways, I was just so excited to tell everybody that I wasn't thinking that I wasn't selling it. I was just telling. I was just sharing. I was like, oh my God, I got daily videos. And why? And, and I was talking about why it was so exciting for me to see these daily videos because, you know, before, like when I was in affiliate marketing, they were literally like, yo, here's the product, go out there and sell it. And like you literally just had to kind of go figure shit out on your own. And I thought this was really cool that Daily Pay was giving you daily videos. At the time, that's what I was excited about. So I was sharing that and people were buying left and, uh, uh, left and right. And that's how I was able to make 9K in three weeks when I first started, right? It wasn't until later on, you know, like people really were buying into my personality more than anything. But what I'm saying is this though, if I had to restart everything all over, I would really go back to that trick. I would stop trying to sell it. Like so many people that get on camera and they're like, hey, imagine living this crazy. Like, no, I can understand that you want to imagine, but quit trying to sell me on a pipe dream. You know what I mean? Because you're not living your pipe dream yourself, right? You're telling me to imagine what something that you're imagining. You see what I'm saying? Like you're trying to give me your vision, right? That you have not even made your vision come true. And there's a major disconnect there, right? Like we can all say that. Imagine waking up all skinny. Imagine waking up being beautiful. Imagine be waking up being rich. We can all fucking try to imagine that, but how are you obtaining the results? So the thing about it is, is you should be sharing your experience along the way. Like, what's your opinion? Why did you start? Why did you grab this product? What do you like about this product, right? What do you get with this product? Like sharing like all types of your experience, maybe like your goals with this product, uh, your goals in general, like the inspiration and stuff, the mindset shifts that you're starting to happen because you got this product. Now, if you do not think this is powerful, I'm going to throw this out there. Why on earth? Would Amazon have an Amazon influencer program? I'll wait. Do you know that there's pretty much like, I would say not every page, but you can go to like a majority of big pages on Amazon, right? And they're going to have a live video of somebody talking about the product. Now, why would they pay this much money to do that? Because they know that somebody sharing their experience with a product helps sell the product more. Do you see where I'm going with this? Now, why would TikTok shop do the same thing? TikTok shop is the same thing. They're taking users to talk about products and just sell on that platform. And TikTok shop is giving them huge leadway. Now, what do you think you could do with your product or your service if you just talked about it like that? If you just shared your experience your uh, inspiration with it, what you are learning, what your goals are, just the, the, like, you know what I'm saying? So therefore you're not just trying to say, hey, listen, I got this way to make money. You wanna make some money? Yeah, some people wanna make money, but like, it's like, okay, cool. 
share me something else, right? Like, like there's this one lady that's blowing up and she does have success, but some of her best videos are her just saying what her life used to be like compared to what it's like now, right? And I know you guys don't have that, but I'm saying why do those videos kind of like, you know, grab us more? It's because then it gives us this real image of somebody making it happen rather than just saying, hey, would you imagine changing your life? Okay, great. I can imagine changing it. So what? You know what I mean? Like, are you changing your life? Because if you changed your life, how are you doing it? Because wouldn't that be ultimately the next question, right? If you said, hey, man, I got this awesome product. Great. How is it helping you? Tell, tell me how awesome your product is without really telling me how awesome your product is. Meaning, show me how awesome your product is without telling me, right? What is it doing for you? Now, the biggest problem that I see in the make money online niche is they start following all these like, you know, gurus or like these, these people that have made it big and they're looking at their chapter 11, right? And thinking that they got to immediately be like that. And no, you don't need it to be like that. Like, all right, for instance, if I said, oh, hey, this is awesome. I had a $2,000 day yesterday. You automatically think, oh, I got to have some money. I got to make some money. So I got to hurry up and make some money and, and, and just sell people on making money. You do and you don't, right? Why don't you just share your experience and your start? Hey, this is day one of my digital marketing career. You know, my, and you know, and um, I'm really excited about it. Digital marketing. I learned about this thing and you just, and you're just talking about what you learned. Do you get that? Because if Amazon influencer programs and TikTok shop caught on on the idea that people can influence other people just by basically showcasing their experience, why wouldn't you do that with your program or your products that you have, right? So pick a product that you really, really like. And here's my thing, guys. I, I'm combating, you know, I've even had videos on uh, my YouTube channel before too because what I wanted to do is help people financially. And so I was like, yo, go to ClickBank. You know what I mean? Get these products, resell it, right? It's free, blah, 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 right? And it, and it is, guys, but the problem is is you're not actually touching the product. You're not actually, you don't even know what this product really is. So you're out here trying to recommend a product that you've never, ever had before. I am telling you right now, this is the new way of doing it. It's not really new, but I'm saying this is the way that's doing it that works. If you can get over the hump of the first couple weeks of maybe not making a dime, but just building your brand and your audience and sharing your experience and your story and your documenting and all that stuff, I'm telling you, and then you get better and better and better, man, I'm telling you, then you'll end up just taking off because people trust you. People are watching your growth. They're like, okay, this, this, this guy's real. He didn't try to sell me in the beginning. He just shared his experience. And it's really different. It's a really different kind of feeling because they don't feel like you're coming off like a fucking infomercial. So, so many people are like, I'm telling you, I, when, when I was in Daily Pay, I still am, but you know what I mean. When I was really promoting daily pay, people like were like, oh, hey, can you look at my TikToks? Can you look at my TikToks? And every time I went to them, I was like, I even felt like, damn, this is like an infomercial. It's like an infomercial. And I was like, and I would turn around and I would say, hey, listen, you know, do you even feel like you're being you? And they're like, no. And I'm like, you're making content where you don't even feel like you're being yourself. Because once again, it's that trigger that says we have to go sell this shit. And I'm telling you right now, you have to have this mindset shift of just taking a product, whatever it is, go out there and get a course that you can resell that you actually like, maybe even go become an affiliate for something, but actually of something that you like that you can recommend. Then you start talk, making videos about it. I don't give a fuck what it is, guys. But like you make videos about it, sharing your experience with it, why you chose it, what's your goal with it, some of the mindset shifts you're going on, give some inspiration every now and then, throw in another video or just something about you every now and then. I wouldn't do like a whole long video about me. I wouldn't necessarily do that, but just, you know, just give bits and pieces of, you know, I'm 
It could be like, I'm super excited to start my digital marketing business because one of my goals is to take care of my family, bro. And then you just elaborate about how you've always wanted to take care of your family, shit like that, right? That's what I'm talking about. But then you just give, all right, here's my opinion on this product. Here's uh, what happens after you buy this product, right? I mean, there's so many different videos that you can make in the beginning to build that up. And then as you're building that up, you start transitioning into what are the desires of the people that you're serving, okay? So anyways, but the start of it is like this. Take a product, go share your experience on it with TikTok, create different videos each and every day. And I'm telling you right now, you can easily see six figures.